I am very, very blessed and extremely happy to have this kind of recognition from an organization like the one I work for. Um, I believe that this has not been an achievement of my own alone, but an achievement of a team. A team where we used to take some level of risk, but we were really fully committed to achieve what we were assigned to. We loved what we were doing, and it is extremely rewarding to know that our head uh, the head of our organization recognized what we are doing. Uh, in many places in, uh, in um, rangelands, the only thing that people can produce and live on is livestock. I work for livestock sector and I support people to actually get their food and livelihood from livestock. That is how I believe that the work I'm doing every day to support smallholders, uh, very poor people, is contributing heavily to get the food on their table and uh, to contribute to that uh, very important goal of ending hunger in the world. It is an achievable goal but we need methodology, we need to be um, working together, not alone, with all partners that are on the field, but we can concentrate and reach there. I believe it is a very important step to put words on what we want to achieve so that it come to everyone who's participating in programs to know that that is the target not to be dispersed or, or scattered in different things, that one is achievable and we can do it. Greatest, uh, it might be difficult to find it, but I think what I'm extremely proud of is to be able to reach a place where different small, small things were done in Somalia and I managed to convince people that we could concentrate on one and have it upscale. And that was to put the program of vaccinating small stocks of poor people at a large scale to cover the country herd and vaccinate again a disease that come and wipe away the asset that poor people have. We've managed with my team in a three years time to cover the population of small ruminants with a vaccine um, that reach a protection of 76%. That to me is a great achievement of the team I was working, working in. I will give a strong word to those who lost their lives when we were trying to support Somali people. Um, we have been doing a vaccination program uh, with a team of UNICEF. And a uh, few weeks later, there was a bomb attack and they lost their life. 13 people lost their life. I will give really a memory to, to them as I'm speaking and I'm thinking.